Morning. I just got ready in ten minutes. <gasps> excuse me. <gasps> Woo! Ooh, excuse me. Um, I'm really, really, really amazing. I'm, I'm so amazing. I, I went from that to this in ten minutes. <gasps> I think I, uh, didn't take enough water with my medicine this morning. Okay, see you later. Today was a nice day. I just got off work. I worked from 9 to 145. You know, I can work 20 hours and still get health insurance. So it's a learning experience. It's a challenge. And I'm glad that I'm off work now. Uh, I'm sorry that I didn't really get to film a whole lot of uh, my friends at work. So anyway, talk to you later. Today when I was at work, I realized that if it was three years ago, that I would have used the opportunity of not working all weekend to have driven down to San Diego to see this guy who's been texting me a lot. He's a guy that I was with three years ago. He was the first guy that I was ever with. I thought about him all the time. Everything reminded me of him. Everything. And I saw him for the first time in a year and a half, three weeks ago. And I'm not thinking about him all the time. In fact, I, I don't think about him at all. And I'm not constantly waiting for him to text me, or call me, or get on Skype with me. I remember how it used to be. I remember how much I would get sad if he wouldn't contact me. And I don't care. He's not the right person for me. And I deal with depression and ADHD. And he doesn't understand that. If you have depression, sometimes there's nothing you can do to not get depressed. The things that I do to help myself not get depressed is eat well, exercise, be with my friends, call my family, hang out with my friends, do my theater company, sleep enough. And if I do those things, especially if I keep in touch with my friends, and I don't get into a bad relationship that's just sex-based and not based on anything else, which is what I'm in right now. Hello, I'm Nanny! Jamie's not eating anything for some reason. Look, I'm having a white milk